We all love our planet, and we do care about it. We care about our environment and our citizens' safety. Our life and well-being depend on them. More than 15 years of development, constantly applying Europe's best engineering and scientific capabilities to make the Copernicus program the most ambitious Earth observation program to date that will allow continuous and global monitoring of land, oceans, and the atmosphere. My name is Mr. Copernicus, and my program has been created to respond to the global challenges of climate change and the ever-growing demands made by the environment. The initiative to launch this program came by the joining of forces of the European Union, the European Space Agency, and the European Environment Agency. My unprecedented global observing system made its first steps on May 19, 1998, when the Baveno Manifesto was signed. With the Kyoto Protocol in mind, all European institutions for space activities sought a long-term commitment to develop space-based environmental monitoring services, making full use of European skills and technologies. In December 2005, my program, which at the time was called GMES, entered a new phase since ESA committed its first funds to the program development that helped me to set up my preliminary services, and among them, the emergency one, in April 2012. On the 3rd of April 2014, my first satellite, Sentinel-1A, was launched from Europe's spaceport in French Guiana. From now on, with the following Sentinel's missions, all European policy and decision makers, but also all citizens on a worldwide scale, will have an unprecedented amount of data on the state of our planet. Hi, Claire. Can you please show these guys how Sentinel-1A delivers us information on our Earth? Sentinel-1A carries an advanced radar instrument to monitor Earth's surface through cloud and rain, and regardless of whether it is day or night. All satellite data collected by its sensors will be constantly downloaded back to Earth. This is done thanks to a number of antennas on the ground receiving data in almost real-time communication with our sentinels. Data are constantly and quickly analyzed in our special data centers where the final product is generated, processed, and disseminated. This constant data stream can be compared with the information we receive from other scientific organizations of the same area and in situ monitoring stations located around the planet in order to get the most accurate information. Thanks to the support of the most advanced technology, we can now disseminate satellite data and related information services in several application fields via smartphones and tablets for the first time accessible to all. The Sentinels provide essential information to manage and conserve our environment in a more suitable way to help mitigate the effects of climate change and to help protect ourselves from natural and man-made hazards. Europe's Copernicus program is now a reality.